problem 36, you're going to be modifying listing 4.11 from the textbook so that the program randomly generates a point within the square whose center is the same as the circle and whose side is equal to the diameter of the circle. And then we want to draw the circle and the point and display whether or not the point is inside the circle. So first we need to import turtle and import random because we'll, we'll be using both of those. Uh, we'll start by getting input from the user. So X1, Y1 will be the center of the circle and radius will be the radius of the circle. And then we want to randomly generate our point. Again, the point should be within a square whose center is the same as the center of the circle and whose side is the diameter of the circle. So we want uh, to, the way that I chose to do this anyway, was to generate a random number and then add to that a random integer that is between x1 minus the radius and x1 plus the radius for our x value and y1 minus the radius and y1 plus the radius for the y value. And then lastly, we need to draw all of this out using turtle. So first we'll start by drawing the circle. So you'll ask turtle to pull up the pen to go to x1 and y1 minus the radius to put the pen down and then draw a circle with radius equal to the radius. Then you want to draw the point. So you want to pick up the pen again, go to x2, y2, put the pen down, and then begin fill. I filled a small um, circle with the color red and then ended the fill. And then to display the status, pick up the pen again, go to I did x1 minus 70, y1 minus the radius minus 20, just to make sure that we're sort of in a good place to actually write out the status. And then we need to determine whether or not the circle is in, or sorry, the point is in the circle. So the point will be inside the circle if the distance from the center of the circle to the point is less than the radius of the circle. So for D, I'm just calculating the distance between the center of the circle and the point. Um, and then if D is less than the rate, less than or equal to the radius, the point is inside the circle. Otherwise it's outside the circle. And then I'll hide turtle and then say turtle done. So let's try that out. Um, let's center our circle on the origin. So zero, zero and enter a radius. How about a radius of 10? And here we have a point that is inside the circle.